today's vlog is going to be more of a day in the life type thing. I realised I never really brought you along with me for a full day and showing you what I got up to. And today's going to be quite an exciting day. This morning I'm going for a meeting with Jimmy Choo. And then this afternoon I'm going to the L'Oreal Colour Trophy event. So it's going to be quite an exciting day. So I'm just going to quickly get ready. I'm just watching some YouTube videos. Yeah, I'll come back in a minute when I'm looking not like this anymore. <laughs> Okay, so I'm finally ready and I'm actually a little bit late, so I need to hurry up. Um, I've just got a, just my usual whistles black dress on. This is just like one of the best things I ever bought ever. And I've got my Jean Vito Rossi's on as well. So I had a great little lunch and now I'm back. And it's actually been so long since I got back that I have actually already just eaten lunch again. So that was almost like a breakfast, rather. That was a breakfast. Just had lunch. I like me and Alex has made lunch. And now I'm just going to sit down and do some work. So I've just been, I don't know if you're going to be able to see this, but I've just been checking out my new comments on my new May Favourites video. Here are. Ooh. And then, oh, it stops in a lovely place. And now I'm just going to write this blog post, which is about um, a dinner me and Alex had at West 36 in Notting Hill. So I'm just about to write that now. And then I need to start getting ready for tonight's event. So I'm going to take off all of this makeup, of course. And I've got a beautiful dress to wear from AQAQ which you may have seen already if you follow me on Instagram. It's a beautiful peach dress, really long maxi with a sequin skirt. Okay, we're back. I've just showered. I'm ready to put on more makeup, hence why I look this dreadful. I'm pretty excited about tonight. I don't really know what to expect from it. Um, so I'm quite looking forward to it and it's also a black tie event and I've never been to a black tie event before so that should be quite nice. Give you an idea as well. This is tonight's dress choice, so it's peach with iridescent um, tail to it, so I need something that will match that. <laughs> So in all honesty, my camera just died um, whilst I was doing that, but I thought, at the end of the day, this isn't really meant to be a full get ready with me, it's meant to be more about going to the event. So I've put on the dress, how beautiful is this dress, seriously, it's absolutely incredible. Um, so just to kind of finish, obviously, while I was doing it, I just shaded, 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 shaded. <laughs> hoping for I couldn't get it as big as I wanted it to and now I've run out of time so it's just going to have to do to be honest it's not the neatest thing I've ever done in my life but I've just straightened this and yeah this will have to be my final look I guess so off to the event Professional side of L'Oreal, but in fact that L'Oreal is a massive yeah, professional hairdressing. 
uh, brand as well. We're going to be seeing some of the finalists of to win the hair trophy. There's so many hairdressers here and hair enthusiasts. So it's really exciting to be here. history of this event and confirm your spot as part of the legacy of this competition. Here we go. The Northern Irish region Young Colourist winner is Emma Reynolds, Rhea Hair and Beauty. but I just wanted to round up this vlog and just say thank you so much to L'Oreal for having me yesterday at the Hair Trophy Awards. It was so cool and it was really kind of inspiring to see so many kind of local hairdressers and hairdressers from all around the UK who were so inspired by hair and were so creative and were just creating these really incredible colours and styles and just really thinking outside the box and to see how happy they were when they won was just so wonderful to see that kind of so much excitement. It's really nice to see the more professional hair side of L'Oreal because obviously they have so many different types of brands that are underneath them. The brand L'Oreal itself has so many different types of things going on in terms of hair and makeup but they also have this very hair professional side and the fact that they have so many hairdressers that work underneath the L'Oreal brand is just really really inspiring it's really great thank you so much L'Oreal for having me I really really hope you enjoyed this vlog just a bit more of a day in the life if you did I could do a lot more of these and show you much more events and things that I'm getting up to let me know down in the comments if you did like it please go give me a like right now it always makes me feel really really happy and subscribe if you're new and I will see you again then bye Mwah. <laughs>